Hello everyone, and welcome back to a new episode of Berserk Boy. Last time we left off, yes, we heard that there were enemies attacking the base. How dare they? So, uh, we're gonna go ahead and give them a good murder today. What else we got? I don't remember exactly where they told me to get to. They're holding back. Let's show them what we've got. So, do I just need to... I guess they're just gonna be a little bit everywhere, huh? I uh, don't know if they gave me, like, a specific place last time, but I'll just work on clearing them all out. I probably needed to go back out to the, uh, one place. Again, there's one in here. Interesting. None of that, please. <clears throat> and now we just go to the left. Yeah, so I think there's just a lot of them hanging out, basically. These are some pretty annoying ones to deal with. Uh, you're a little bit better. Yeah, the other ones were way worse. Let's see, are they gonna be out here again? Um, by the way... Yes, that does work. Oh yeah, we do, we do have Ice Kunai to use now. I haven't really used it that much. Um... Wait, what? Is that not what you want me to do? Oh, you want me to hit it with that? Okay. Yeah, we should we should be using our ice kunai, I suppose. These enemies uh, do seem like they're ripe to be killed by it. Um. Huh. I wonder if there would be something over here if uh wasn't doing this currently. Let's see. So we have like my my dash, like I do in my uh, electric one. So, I do feel like I'm gonna like Ice Kunai a fair bit. I must say. It seems like it'll be a nice one. I do wonder if these, like, home in at all or anything. Because, uh, I feel like they, they need to for me to really, really like using them here. I just like that it has the same dash as my other thing does. Alright. There you are. Good. Looks like that's all of them. No fear. Kane and Fiora are here. Right, back to business. Yep. Okay. Have no fear. Amy Rose is here. That's all I can think of. God. Alright, let's go ahead and get down. But yeah, I like this quite a bit. It seems very good. We'll be interested in seeing what uh, other abilities I can unlock for it and stuff. But yeah, like, just having my, my good dash back is Let's see what we've got here. very, very nice. Um, large scale dice deck. Drop dash in order to get a quick speed boost? Oh, that's neat. Yeah, because I noticed we have that, like, drop. Throw kunai's faster. It's this. Huh. I'm guessing that's what it's talking about. Well, that would, that would be an interesting one to start using. Alright. Running out of energy very, very quickly here. Hello, I'm ready for my new stage. Yes, I am. Okay, Frozen Temple, Abandoned Labyrinth. Um, we should probably try checking out some of these other things. So let's, let's go back to Mission 1. And just see if I can, uh, locate anything that I can do either with the Flame Drill or this. So we'll see. I immediately can't help but notice that there's stuff up here. Interesting. That is like way, way up there. Huh. Alright. I mean, maybe there is some secret stuff. I do need to look for that. Huh. Yeah. It would be kind of hard to get up there that way. I guess I can jump on this wall, yeah. I didn't think I'd be able to jump on that since it wasn't actually a wall, but no, we super can. Ooh, look at that. Is that me sticking to ceilings? Can I do that with any ceiling? No, it's just like off of these platforms. I can kind of hang off of them if I'm holding up when I jump at them. 
Ooh, that is a slight difference using Ice Kunai. I go through enemies instead of, like, kind of bouncing off of them like I do with this. Instead of bouncing off, I just go straight through. Ooh, hello, is this something? Oh yeah, there's a resistance member. Okay, cool. Found another one. That one was just cheekily hidden. Okay, here's another one of these, and yeah, we can kind of hold on to these. I'm actually trying to go in there, please. Huh. Yeah, okay, it wouldn't let me do it. Hello. Save the others. Ah, and this is like a new area. I was... Oh, wait, 60%? Wait, have I? I don't think I've been in here, actually. Yeah. Because, yeah, I was thinking of the 60% in the other area, but now nah, we've never actually done this one. Let's use, uh, our ice kunai a little bit. Um, so we do throw them in a straight line if we're standing on the ground when we chalk them, which does make them incredibly, incredibly powerful in that regard. It does suck how we, um, get stuck on ceilings, though. That is, uh, an unfortunate one. But... Uh... Probably gonna be one of these. There we go. Got it. Okay. Yeah, that wasn't bad. And I even used, like, all three of my modes there. Ooh, look at all the things. Even got a Berserk Metal. Looks so it looks useful. Should head to a teleporter. Okay, still 15% more to get, but that was a pretty big get there. Oh, and here's the place we need drill claw for. Okay, we're finding a lot of good stuff here. There we are. Are you okay there? Hi. There we go. Yeah, this seems very, very good for combat. Even even better than our previous one. Like, look at that speed. There we are. Very, very good against ground-based enemies. Like, you throw shurikens out so fast. There we are. God, it's so fast. Okay. Take this to a teleporter. I do like the look of it, too. It just looks really neat. So there's my other Berserk coin. God, we're getting a lot of these things that we needed- that we were missing from this level. Aha! Uh -huh. Here's another metal for me. That was a pretty easy one. Ooh, I see that. That is cheeky. That is mean. It's like a one-by-one one that you have to jump into right there. And the platform below you falls, so that one's extra tricky. <clears throat> Swarp you to safety. Thank you. 75%. And another coin. That might be all of them for this level. Here is the next thing that we need. Hello. Bing bing. Okay, 80%. Almost there. There's another drill spot. So what do we got in here? I guess this is just... Yeah, I remember this being just a shortcut. I remember talking last time about how, oh, this is just a shortcut that uh, I'll have access to later. So yeah, it's just a faster way around here. But... Okay. Hopefully that means we're running into something soon. Hmm. Only three out of five medals. Uh, interesting. I really would have thought... Let's find out what you got. I would have had all the medals, or at least close to it. But, uh... Yeah, I don't even have, um... I don't even have all of the resistance and stuff. And now I gotta refight this thing. Alright. Level finished. Um... Still don't know where I was missing the rest of that stuff. We'll, we'll have to possibly take multiple trips. Do it. Seems like this game hides things very, very well. I mean, I got way more, so... You know. 
I guess there is the idea that maybe that I had earlier that maybe if you do it perfectly, you get um you get a little bit of resistance stuff. Like if you don't die at all when going through a mission. Um, cause yeah, we're nearly at the end on uh, the resistance meter there. Um, so let's go ahead and do some stuff in the abandoned labyrinth. Now traverse through the jungle. Start mission seven. And probably gonna want to be using my ice kunai here. Hi. Wow, this place looks amazing. It's pretty different from the other sectors. Yeah, it looks pretty abandoned around here. Guessing we're in sector three. Can you hear me, Kay? Looks like the orbs in this area. We're assuming they chose sector three as nobody lives here anymore. This place is gonna be crawling with dark energy. Be careful. Gotcha. Who are all of these people then? Robots? I guess they're I guess they're just robots. Or like golems? I, I, it feels weird that they didn't talk about these at all. We mention them. Ice and I can throw projectiles in a straight line. LT through enemies to phase through them. Pressing and holding another direction will shoot you in another direction. Dash into lanterns to travel farther. Attach to certain objects by holding on up while jumping. Bounce on enemies by drop dashing on their heads. Okay, so that's... Yeah, you go through enemies and can then keep going after. Neat. Okay. This just totally trivializes those dorks. And then these are the things I can hold on to. Yeah. I can do some of that. Uh, hi. I'm trying to hit you. There we go. Yeah, I'm not quite as good at this one as I... Or not quite as comfortable, rather. As I feel with, um, the shock one. But we'll try it. I'm just gonna Goomba Stomp you. Okay. Uh, there's a shock door. Can't hit it. Can I hit it like that? I can! That does work. Cool. Glad I gave that a shot. I don't know if that's what it intended or not, but... Hell, it works. Uh, there's another shocky. <laughs> oh, it probably intended for me to go get this one and go over there, but I just shot it with, uh... Whoop. Um, with the thing. That seemed like the more effective way to do it, you know? Just cheese it a bit. Just saw you hiding there. The cheek. Hold on to that thing for dear life. Uh, I also don't die to that, I guess. Hello. Um, so we need to go... Yeah, I, I can only ever go through these with this. But the other thing, I just, like, stick to it. It's weird. Okay, we need 60. Oh, is that... I have to get here in 60 seconds? It reminds me of the, of the doors in, like, Dead Cells, because it doesn't say resistance percentage, specifically. It just says 60. I do wonder if it's a timed door. That would be wild. Uh, I can't go up, right? Well, I can, but... No real reason to. Um... Hmm... I guess... Yeah, let's do this. There we go. That's what I want to do to grab you. I like their cool little arms. Their arms are pretty neat. I saw an area over there that didn't have a death, like, pit indicator just in, like, one spot, but I don't think that's something. I'm gonna guess it's not. It's fine with me. Yeah, you just, like, can't get in here because you have to press up and A to jump up there. But if you hold A, you're you're stuck in the thing, so I think this is the only way those are gonna work for me. I don't know, maybe I'm bad. There we go. Those spikes are very, very much scraping me. Ow. Big jerk. 
Very easy to kill with this. If you just spam the button a lot. Oh, I got a shuriken in it. A little enemies hanging out over there. Get out of here, monkey. There we go. Just spikes. And now we're back to this. Drill claw! And... Bang. God, these enemies are so much easier to kill in this mode than anything else. This is just really the combat mode. For all intents and purposes for me. It's just so strong. Like, it kills things so, so easily. Um, oh, okay. That's one that's gonna fall. I mean, not that I needed it anyway, but... Okay, guessing that was just a tutorial to show me how these worked for that particular spot. Beautiful. Don't see anything else to do up there. Uh, go through there. Uh, there we go. What was down here? Anything? Just death. Okay, just wanted to be sure. I haven't gotten like a secret or anything in a while. Feel a little bit scared about that. Like I'm potentially missing something, but we will see. Out of here. Go away. Not what I wanted to do, but it's fine. This looks useful. Yeah, still don't know what those are used for yet, but. 50% resistance members on my first trip's not bad, though, I don't think. I mean, I said kunai was very, very strong for ground enemies, but so is this. Like, that's the thing. It's just strong. I feel like the Lightning Justice does, like, a little bit too much damage. It's just too good. Which, I mean, I, I, I guess that's good. It's my first one. <laughs> but, uh, it trivializes the other's combat capabilities a little bit, in my opinion. And I'm taking some big damage here. Here's my heal. This is a long level. I think that's our last checkpoint before the boss, though. Hello. 70%. Okay. Um. Okay, I see what you expect from me here. Okay. I should have jumped. Damn. Let's see what I did wrong there. There, yeah. There was a few things I could have done to not die there. And I did none of Oh my god, I always I always want to dash into those because I I dash into those with um my lightning ability, but for those you specifically have to hit them with the shuriken to get rid of them. I always just try to dash into them, but that that doesn't work. Uh, I want that HP. No, please. There you go. And grinding. There. Ow! Trick spikes. Stop it. Ow. Okay, let's get in this mode. Clearly need it. Uh... Yeah, I see that. There we go. Whew. Okay. There we are. No reason to go to the left. Ooh, how do I get to you? There's my 90%, just like that? Just like that. Huh. Would have expected it to be that easy. 
Now I just need to get to you. There we go. Whew. Was a little bit scared, but we're fine. Okay, is this the spider? What is this? Oh, you're new. It's a turtle. Tortoise, rather. Mm -hmm. you definitely want me using that. Okay, watch out for laser beam, I guess. Okay, my goodness. I gotta... Yeah. It's something in my eyes. There we go. Ah! That's not what I meant to do. Yeah, okay. That thing hurts. Do I need to re-get my Berserk Metal? I'm glad I checked, because yes, I did. Okay, so... I mean, I think it just has a lot of HP. We just have to hit it in the face a bunch. Um, I do want to see what my Berserk is with this. Okay, that's what it looks like. Just make sure you don't press X against this thing. That's the main thing. Okay, when its head comes out again, we'll hit it with our ice. Yeah, you do give me a big warning before that. Oh my god! I was trying to wall jump to get back up, but it like stun locked me down there. I should have done the dash. But yeah, it got me... It like knocked me back down into it. I was trying to wall jump to get back up. Okay, you little shit. There. Damn it. My X, X being dash is screwing me up. I should have never gotten into the habit of using X for dash. Because it always makes me think it's an attacking button. Because usually it is. Oh my god. Down. <laughs> I'm getting bodied by this stupid thing. Mostly because that beam hurts like shit. And I'm really, really bad at bob uh, dodging it. Yeah, blah, blah, warning. I I've seen this warning twice now. I think we're good. I've gotten bodied by it. Ow. Stupid rocks hurt too. Yeah, in this phase, it's just dodging bombs. Okay, now, jump up onto that. That's totally getting my leg. Ow. I did the thing where I pressed the wrong button again. Okay, I think we're living this time, though. <laughs> that would be one if I was playing on the retro difficulty. That would absolutely kick my ass. <sighs> Two out of five coins. But we got 90%. Three deaths, four, five, five deaths. Gotta see. Alright. I do have a bunch of coins and stuff to spend, or money and stuff to spend, but we'll do that next time. So, hope you've enjoyed, and I'll see you next time for some more.